on the top left is some super basic information. You can see at the very top, you've got dates, uh, just to tell you like what year is this K1 for. Um, and, and that's helpful to just kind of look at and make sure it's the year that you're expecting. Uh, and then the information about the partnership, uh, the EIN name, address, and then your name, uh, social security uh, and address. You always wanna check this. I've seen errors come through before where a uh, social security numbers transposed or wrong, um, or it's in the, the name of an individual where it should be in the name of a trust. Those kinds of things are always important just to double check when you get the K-1. Um, because once it's filed with the IRS, if it's wrong, it's, it's a problem um, and it needs to go back and be fixed and, and refiled.